Hey there, Sharon Horn Elstrom here. How do you touch base? Our idiom, our expression today for supersize your business is a touch base. Now, I actually wrote this down. I'm grabbing my magnifying glass and I have to read this to you because I had me laughing out loud when I read the description on Google or I listened to the description on Google about the origin of this particular idiom. It comes from baseball, of course, where you have to touch the base with your foot or your hand or some part of your body in order for the run to count. Now, <laughs> here's verbatim what it said. Mostly used by asshat salesmen and contractors when they went to talk to you over the phone to see if you are interested in something they have to sell, usually around dinner time. I thought that was hilarious. Now, there's a lot of different ways of talking about touching base. It, of course, means to get in contact with someone or to get back in contact with someone or to follow up with someone or the horrible new expression to circle back with someone. Uh, there's a lot of expressions, there's a lot of other ways of describing this activity, the activity of getting in touch with people. Of course, if you're in business and if you've ever been in sales or in any type of business, you know that a lot of times people do not buy from you any of your products or services or solutions to their problems the first time you come in contact with them. I think that statistics have it up to like 15 to 17 times somebody has to be exposed to you, your business, your product, your services before they're going to buy from you. So it's important that we have a way to touch base or get back in touch with people or follow up with people. Um, there's a lot of different ways of saying to get in contact with. You can say huddle about, you can say speak about, you can say talk through something, you can share your thoughts or share our thoughts about something, you can brief each other on something, you can update each other, you can give each other the news or share your progress on a particular project or something. There's a lot of different ways of saying it, but basically it's to get in touch or get in contact with someone. Share in the comments below how you like to best get in touch or stay in touch with people, and we'll learn from one another. That is our idiom and our expression for today. Have an awesome day, and I will, of course, be with you tomorrow with another interesting idiom. What does it mean? Where does it come from? And how might you use it in your business and your life today? Take care.